Hi everyone, in this video I want to show you how to use the uh, Instagram Stories templates here, here from Embato Elements. You can have a wide access to different types of Instagram Stories. You can just search for them. We can go here from the video templates or if you only wanted to have a static visual then you can use the graphic templates. But in this case, we're going to use a After Effects templates that they use. They have different kind of really good After Effects templates that are re really easy to customize. So we can keep here searching for which one could be the one that it's more adapted to your needs. There are hundreds of it, so it will depend on, on your needs so i will just grab this one and download it so just to show how to work with the template okay so once we downloaded the file and we open it we can go here on the left side we can see the two folders in this case this one, do not touch this folder, it's the solids and many uh, fix things. It's better or if you don't have any experience with After Effects, better not to move with it. But if you have a little bit, then you know where to change some things. And they will have different numbers here. And you can see here by clicking, you can see the composition. And for example, here in edit, you can add your images and change your texts. So let's say, okay, you can click here on file and then import in here on file again, so that you can uh, use any one of the files that you want. Here, my recommendation is, if you already have Embato elements, you can use the stock video or the stock photos. So I will just grab a stock photo of, I don't know, business. And then I will just grab one that it's kind of suitable for it. This woman, let's say, walking. You can download and add it here, here to your recent uh, project so that you can also have the license of the video. So once you selected the file that you wanted to use from Embato Element, you can just import. You just grab it from here, then you just drop. Since here it's landscape, let's use here with S on the keyboard. You can increase the scale. And let's say that here it will fit. Here we will have on screen the woman walking. Okay, we go back here and so we'll have this, for example, in our video, Instagram videos, how will it will look. And let's say business consultant. Here, change it to 100. So if the text is too big, we just select all. Here on our character, we can reduce the size so that it fits to the frame. We can go back here to look if it's here so we can see that it's on the below side of the rectangle. So we can go here again and on a line, we just here on composition, it will go to the center size, business consultant. Now let's change text number two, call now. Or if you want to call now, let's say 
the number one six six three nine seven seven seven. And as easy as that, you can have here, I will render it and show you the preview of the video. So that's a preview. You already have here the swipe up, the animations. And if you have want to change here some settings on FX, especially here the colors. Let's say this to yellow, green, blue. You already have here the settings. I'll keep it at, at white. Let's say the second text, I will change it to more a yellow color. Until now. Also the colors of the outer lines. Backgrounds. If you want here the swipe Here we have the swipe up, so we can turn it off or on. And here is just one sample. If you want to try another Instagram story, we can go here to Instagram too. We will go here to image one. I will import the same one just for showing this tutorial. We scale again. We will change our text. Text one. Business. Console that. We will center it. We look here how it, it seems, how it looks. This one looks kind of weird because of the double image. So let's say this is, doesn't really work well. So that's a good thing, like if you don't want, you can just try another one. And the ones that, that fit for your needs, you can be changing. Or if you already have knowledge, or if you don't have knowledge of uh, after Effects, you can go here. This is the shy button, and then you can see here to look for the adjustment. And here on the hide button, you can either see or or hide the image. As easy as that, but if you don't really know about factor effects, it will take you a time to figure it out which one is the proper image. This was really easy, it only has image one, two, twice. So here you can change. And again, Instagram three, you do exactly the same. You go to image, choose the image that you really want, click on scale. Change the text, let's say business, text to consultant, text three, let's say call now. And we open image three. We will have here the same square settings. We will go here to Let's see, mask rotation, yeah. Here, okay, now it's fixed. Then we have a, here another sample. 
I will render and then show it again. Here's another example running for another Instagram story. So just to render, you just go to File, and then you just go Export, and then to render, you just go to File, Export, and then Add to Adobe Media Encoder. 